It's Monday, the 31st of August. In England, it's a big holiday, but here, back in Poland, it's the preschool day. And today, people are getting ready for the kids to go back to school tomorrow. I'm back from Croatia, it was hot over there. It's quite warm here in Poland, but you can see behind me uh, the dark clouds looming behind there in the background. This is Olsztyn. Olsztyn is uh, the capital of Missouri. And this is where I first started my journey uh, when I first landed on the shores of Poland. I was a teacher here at the university called Kotovo. And um, it was one of the best things that ever happened to me in my life was, um, you know, landing in Poland uh, from England. So this, uh, this town, this city of Olsztyn has very, very sentimental uh, feelings for me. It's where my friends live. It's where I started on my journey as a teacher. So uh, I come here very, very regularly. It's about half an hour from Ostruda. But um, I'm taking this from the top of the shopping center. So behind me, uh, you can see, um, not very much, you see the trees. I guess if I go that way around, I can give you a bit of a view. There's a road. You can't really see much of it. It's a big city, so uh, 175,000 people. But anyway, I'm back from Croatia. This is an update for you. Uh, the kids are getting ready back to school tomorrow. I'm preparing for getting back to work and um, the students are already contacting me asking me when I'm going to be ready to teach which is very exciting I'm looking forward to that of course I love what I do as you know and um, we're going to have to have all the hand sanitizers and things and make sure we are abiding by the rules which we generally do which we do we will be doing for sure um, in Poland at the moment um, things are a little bit up and down with some things uh, with the COVID, I'm not going to go for the numbers, but I know in Silesia, the south of Poland, uh, they have an increase in the Krakow area. There's a bit of an increase. Um, is this the second wave? Who knows? I really don't know. Here in Missouri, we seem to be quite low at the moment. It's not too bad. Uh, but say down south of Poland, it's a different picture. What's your opinion on that? What do you think about that? What do you think is going to happen to the end of the year? With the schools, uh, some people are predicting that the schools will stay open for two weeks and then they think that all the kids will be coming home again. A bit optimistic. I'm more pessimistic. I think it will work out. What do you think? What's your opinion? Is it too early or it's time to go back and it's time to sort things out? Write your comments below. I always read them and thank you very much for those. Um, in Poland, over here, the big headlines, or big headline, not a big headline, but certainly in the media, are the LGBT protests in Warsaw and um, the, uh, the, the LGBT free zones that are basically in the south, uh, southeast of Poland. And uh, they do exist because I've checked them uh, on the internet and saw the council meetings. What's your opinion about all this? It's, um, you know, there's, it seems to be fairly divided. But I'm interested in what you think about the LGBT problems in Poland and the, and the zones. Write down your opinion. Even though I don't agree, I will read them, of course. But just keep the language nice. Uh, inflation, apparently, Poland is officially um, in recession. I don't know. Uh, I read some websites, websites where um, they, um, the World Bank monetary system says it's officially in recession or your head of finance says it's in recession. Other websites are saying Poland is doing quite well considering. You know, it's doing better than other European countries and um, not to worry, uh, everything will be okay. She's got a strong economy. What's your opinion from where you are? What do you see about the financial situation of Poland at the moment? Um, coming back from Poland, uh, from Croatia, price comparative, um, I don't know, bananas I'm paying, four zwoty, 50, apples are three, bread is uh, four, three, four zwoty now. Butter is five zwoty, you know, with standard stuff, right? Milk, I'm paying 350. I see I do the shopping, can't you? I do all the shopping. And um, so in Croatia, I think it was slightly more expensive, but not too much. So uh, any reasons for that? Any comments on that? I'm promoting try to buy local where I can. Um, so that's the situation here in Poland. We're still wearing masks generally. People are still being fairly responsible. 
Uh, oh, I've heard that some shops have Christmas presents in and cards already. No, please keep Christmas in December. It's too early. The sun is still shining. Look, I'm still topping up my tan here on top of the shopping center in the car park. In fact, this is quite a good place to, to just relax and have a suntan, isn't it? And sunbathe on the car park. Um, so, yeah, here I am at the top of the car park of the shopping center. It's Missouri in Austin, where I'm going to go and um, try and find some um, clothes for my kids. And also, I'm going to try and find uh, a bread maker because I want to start making my own bread. Uh, Polish bread is very good, but it's getting more and more expensive and we get through a lot of bread. So that's just by the way, that's what I'm planning to do. Um, apart from that, uh, life goes on. We'll see what happens with the, um, with the groups next week and um, with the schools. Like I say, people are still coming to my school. I'm hoping this time we can, I can teach face-to-face. -face. Uh, the online's okay, but it is nice to be able to have the face-to-face -face contact when I'm teaching people, which is fairly obvious, I think. So we'll see how it all goes anyway. So I'll give you an update. Um, this is just a little vlog just to show you that I'm back and bring up to date with you. I'm gonna go shopping and, um, oh, in a shopping center, they do a very nice uh, Vietnamese soup, which I like. I don't know if you like that, but it's got coriander and, and um, it's tofu. So it's vegetarian. I quite like that because it's, it's quite healthy and it, that aroma of all the chilies and the tofu and, and the coriander and um, all the other spices is lovely. So I'm going to go and have my tofu soup. Okay, guys, whatever you're doing, be healthy. Uh, thank you very much for all your lovely comments, all the very nice things you say. I appreciate it. Even if we don't agree with each other, it is nice to read your comments. If I give you a heart and a thumbs up, it means I've read it and I thank you very much for that. And where I can write back, I do. So please keep watching. I'll keep vlogging. And uh, give me a like if you like me and subscribe um, if you want to see some more videos. Take care, be healthy, and I'll see you next video. Have a good day. Bye-bye.